Hello everybody, Mrs. Kelly here. I'm missing you all so much. Hope you're all doing really well and looking after yourselves and staying safe. We thought it might be nice to share some nighttime stories with you. So first up, I have the story, Guess How Much I Love You. And this is a favourite in our house. So I'm hoping that you will enjoy it as well. So snuggle up together, get ready, and we'll have a read. Ready. Little Nut Brown Hair, who was going to bed, held on tight to Big Nut Brown Hair's very long ears. He wanted to be sure that Big Nut Brown Hair was listening. Guess how much I love you, he said. Oh, I don't think I can guess that, said Big Nut Brown Hair. This much, said Little Nut Brown Hair, stretching out his arms as wide as they could go. Big Nut Brown Hair had even longer arms, but I love you this much, he said. Hmm, that is a lot, thought Little Nut Brown Hair. I love you as high as I can reach, said Little Nut Brown Hair. I love you as high as I can reach, said Big Nut Brown Hair. That is quite high, thought Little Nut Brown Hair. I wish I had arms like that. Then Little Nut Brown Hair had a good idea. He tumbled upside down and reached at the tree trunk with his feet. I love you all the way up to my toes, he said. And I love you all the way up to your toes, said Big Nut Brown Hair, swinging him up over his head. I love you as high as I can hop, laughed Little Nut Brown Hair, bouncing up and down. But I love you as high as I can hop, smiled Big Nut Brown Hair, and he hopped up so high that his ears touched the branches above. That's good hopping, thought Little Nut Brown Hair. I wish I could hop like that. I love you all the way down the lane as far as the river, said Little Nut Brown Hair. I love you across the river and over the hills, said Big Nut Brown Hair. That's very far thought Little Nut Brown Hair. He was almost too sleepy to think anymore. Then he looked behind the thorn bushes out into the big dark night. Nothing could be further than the sky. I love you right up to the moon, he said, and he closed his eyes. Oh, that's far, said Big Nut Brown Hair. That is very, very far. Big Nut Brown Hair settled Little Nut Brown Hair into his bed of leaves. He leaned over and kissed him good night. Then he lay down close by and whispered with a smile, I love you right up to the moon and back. And that is the end of our story. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you all have a great night's sleep and we will see you again very soon for another story.